Hello again. Uh, today we're going to be looking at creating a really nice feathered edge effect on your photograph, just like the one I've got here. It's an extremely simple process to do. Shouldn't take you too long once you've mastered it. And hopefully after this tutorial, you'll be able to create some nice effects of your own. I'm going to close this image because this is purely to show you what the end result will look like. And we're going to work with this image here. Now the first thing we need to do is create a copy of this image and we do that by right clicking where the image is here on the right hand side and hit duplicate layer doesn't matter what you call it at this stage there you go it's created a copy over the right hand side next we need to put a layer mask on this and the layer mask icon is down the bottom here highlight the background copy and hit layer mask and it's put one next to it as you can see there the next thing we need to do is go back to the background which is the layer now at the very bottom of the pile and we need to paint this white make sure you have your white selected over here and the easiest way to paint the complete image is hold down the alt key and press backspace and you can see on the right hand side it's painted the whole image white next thing we need to do is paint the layer mask black and I'll show you why we're going to do that in a moment but for now let's make sure we have the black selected make sure we have the layer mask selected and we do the same again alt and backspace and it's painted it black now as you can see the reason for painting it black is that it blocks out every single part of this image which is now on top and allows the image underneath to shine through and that's the main reason why we've painted the, the image underneath white because the white is the color that we want the edge to be we now go over here and grab the paint tool and make sure you've got a decent sized brush if it's too small the effect won't work if it's too big it might not be as easy to control but you can see it flashing on the screen there that's about a good size image set the opacity to about 75 percent and we select the white color here make sure that is selected to white and basically we just start painting and you can see already because we're painting and we have the opacity set to about three quarters it's allowing very very slowly the image underneath to shine through and you can just keep on painting with this you might have to click a few times to really get the fine detail through in the places you want it but uh, it, it's just about the easiest way to create a really nice soft effect make sure you get all the uh, all the detail in the middle of the picture and it's as simple as that Hope you've enjoyed this tutorial and I'll talk to you again soon.